Hey Stuart, I think that comedian might be your father. <laughs> and then the night. Sorry. <laughs> I dream you are an upturned otter, see myself as a pebble between your paws. You toy me this way, that way. Measure me as a thing to keep or drop. Maybe use my face to smash oysters. If you cast me down, down to the very ocean's floor, I would wait to catch the dilute sun melting through the fathoms. Return its winking, send up glints, and you above catch my drenched gleam in your emetropian eye. Confuse my dull thud for a minnow's slick. Return to test my flesh. Remind yourself. Bite in. See how right you were in your rejection. I am chill on your tongue. My granite thew too chokeable. Your webbed clutch is a bed of leather, a cup of padding and claw. I am wanting to be in under fur, roly poorly against your seaborn heart. The outline of you sculling the surface, pencil line of bubbled air banding round your mass, a half sunk hull. You fill the ring of my snell's window. Pouch me under arm, whisker me, I can help you with your hunting. When you put your teeth to the softer side of an urchin, I could make a schism of myself. Slowly drifting sand covers my thunk. Soon I will not hear the clearness of your song. Threat not, says I to me. Stone has a memory, same as other stuff. Turn my gaze inward, remember how it was. And yet, I watch you slumber, snagged in kelp, head lolled, drowsy, gapy mouth, string of salt saliva swimming chinward. Maybe I should tempt anemones to my head, wear them as jellied caps. Maybe that would be better for my brain than this gorplement of your hairy arse, your anti-clockwise basque as you skiff the waves above. Dizzied is what I have been. Down here, peace at least. The tickle of crab feet, a limpet's kiss. I grow used to the feel of eroding. The ages shift a blanket, coral sprouts in townscapes of mystery on my back. While you are bones, I shall be eternal for as long as there are oceans. Whale song, cucumbers with frills, I will think myself fool that I hankered after you. Those deep water noises make a sound like souls letting go of the aches life left. They are what I hear, this under-sing, under-sand, under-you. Thank you. It started with a message. I liked your picture and the way you wrote. I promised you a picnic. Three weeks later we met. We made awkward conversation over cups of tea, surrounded by nerds playing Pokemon. You apologised for your appearance. I've never been more puzzled. You were, are, beautiful. It continued with a platypus. You smiled and you dubbed him Piratopus. You rewarded me with a hug. It was lingering and confusing. I began to fall. A week later we kissed. You told tales at a party. You lit up the room. I fell further. We had our first date. It was cold and wet. But you trekked my local park like it was an enchanted forest. We stood on a hill 
you held my hand, and I loved you. What happened next was a blur. Many dates, kisses, and walks. I found confidence I didn't know I had. I moved house, made friends. I lost you. I lost myself. I lost hope. For three months I lived in darkness. I cursed you. I cursed me. I cursed the world. But I found you again. We picked up where we left off, with added understanding. You make me want to be less of a non-entity, more pleasing aesthetically, less prone to perplexity. You make me want to be a better me. And for that, I will always love you.